Hey there everyone, this is Nathan Hartono and welcome to this week's webisode of Tomasic Presents Jubilee at the Botanics. Over the last two weeks, we've met some of the key individuals in the orchestra to get a better understanding of some of their roles. But just as important are the instruments. So today, we're going to take a closer look at one of them. So is it true that the sheng is one of the oldest Chinese wind instruments ever? Yes, I think it's the, one of the most ancient instruments in China. First sheng we can just track is from the warring states. I think it's over 3,000 years already. The sheng transferred to the Western world and then it kind of influenced the invention of harmonica and the organ. It's an ancestor free reed instrument. First saw this instrument during my secondary school. It's my school Chinese orchestra. They kind of hold some recruitment showcasing all the Chinese instruments. I try out the shun. When we just press the key and then we just blow in air. Yeah. A very beautiful sound mm. will be coming out. That is quite a sense of satisfaction. And then I just feel in the forms out. Oh, I need to learn this. We have here before us a very interesting table. Mm -hmm. um, these are some of the oddest looking instruments I've ever seen. And this is your shun collection. Yeah, you, so you can see all kinds of different shape of shuns and great variety of that. This is the Chuan Shen, mm. and then we, and we can see most common in playing some solo piece. Mm. And then which this is the first one that I start with. And then as you can see that uh, this is 21 bamboo pipes here. And then each bamboo pipes is independent one. In this one, you can see there are some metal pipes mm. as used for uh, amplifying the sound. The because this instrument is invented mainly for the use in the Chinese orchestra. Here is the mini shen, xiu, xiu zhen shen. So they wanted to make a miniature version of the shen. Yeah. For this one, you can see it's much larger. Yeah. And then this is called the alto shen. So let's go hear the alto shen for a little bit. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Don't forget to tune in next week as Koei and I bring you the very last episode of our special behind the scenes look at Jubilee at the Botanics as we bring you Eastern and Western music put together for a very special performance just for you. So, bye for now. See you then. If you enjoyed going behind the scenes with me today, don't forget to subscribe and follow all of our social media channels so you can be completely up to date with Tomastic Presents Jubilee at the Botanics.